to a very different story. One that is coming into us, in fact, from Canada, where we're learning that a gangster was shot to death early Sunday morning after leaving a wedding at Vancouver's Fraser View Hall. This is Amarpreet Samra. He's 28. He was a uh, UN gangster, as you can see. He's been. He was on the dance floor when this incident took place, uh, and as you can see, he was with wedding guests for less than 30 minutes before he was shot. Now, all of this action took place early in the morning, 1:30 a.m. in the morning. Uh, reports are indicating that he was possibly shot at by a rival gang. But we'll bring you more context in just a few minutes when we have a reporter join us. Police are concerned about the possible retaliation incidents that could take place. My colleague Siddhant is with us right now to bring us more context on this entire story. Uh, Siddhant, context required on who he was, what the larger context around him was, particularly for Indian audiences. Can you bring us context? Well, uh, he was a US designated gangster. And in fact, uh, you know, it, it, the larger issue is uh, and in fact, the larger concern is uh, with regards to the growing influence of gangs in, in Vancouver and hold of uh, all of Canada. And in fact, uh, this particular uh, shootout took place yesterday where Amarpeet Samra, one of the U.S. designated gangsters, has been killed while he was attending a wedding in Vancouver. And uh, right at the banquet, Fraser View Hall, this particular incident took place. And in fact... Uh, a uh, few uh, uh, minutes away, uh, even a vehicle was spotted, uh, you know, uh, uh, spotted burning. Uh, the police has lodged investigation in this entire matter. And prime of a site, uh, we have been told that this is this could be a case of inter-gang rivalry. And since uh, these elements, uh, these anti anti-social elements are are you know are are, are grow, their influence is growing in Canada, Vancouver, Surrey, and whole of uh, North America. And in fact, uh, that uh, the, those particular uh, destinations have become breeding ground for such gangsters. In fact, many of them have also been involved in anti-India activities uh, in terms of, uh, you know, uh, uh, mobilizing uh, youth in Canada. Uh, and in fact, you know, uh, they are also linked with anti-India uh, elements here in, back in India. So they have, uh, they have roles to play with regards to Indian national security also. And this is perhaps the reason that this particular incident is being taken very seriously. Uh, by the authorities in Canada. In fact, the Indian authorities are also keeping a close eye because, in fact, uh, even when we talk about Sidhu, Mus Sidhu Musewala's killing, it has uh, uh, connections with uh, with Canada-based gangsters. And if we talk about Lawrence Bishnu, then again, it has connections with, he has connections with uh, Canada-based gangsters. So, you know, Canada and the whole of North America is turning, uh, turning to be a breeding ground for these gangs and, and, and these gangsters. Back to you. Uh, can you just tell us right now, Siddhant, more about the gang itself right now? You were saying it is a uh, United States designated gang. What does that mean? Could you give us context? Well, that's right. So uh, this is a UN. He was a UN designated gangster, and in fact, uh, there were there were multiple cases of uh, of uh, of murder, of uh, of abduction against this fellow. But he was roaming freely in Vancouver. In fact, there were many lookout notices also against him. But he was managing to evade those notices and authorities. Uh, successfully, but uh, but uh, but the time he decided to go for this wedding, uh, the rival gang got a tip uh, regarding that, and immediately the shooters were sent, or perhaps the shooter was sent uh, to the same hall where he was taking part in a, in, a, in a wedding ceremony, and and shootout took place where he was killed. And right now, uh, police is looking out for 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 for, for those uh, who have killed him, and uh, the entire area is on high alert. Okay, all right. Thank you for bringing us that context, Siddhant. All right, let's move on now.